guys today i just wanted to do a quick video on how to replace uh push buttons from a control box and for whatever reason i get asked a lot especially from our beginning uh tech technicians that are weekly hire and for whatever reason they just don't get to take uh buttons apart while they're learning in school so i hope this helps out anybody so let me show you the insides of these uh, push buttons so we have uh, two components for it. We have the contacts. For example, this is a normally open contact with uh, light right here, indicator light. And we have normally closed uh, contacts. So the way that these work is that they have a little screw right here that tensions the bracket to the control box it pushes against it so it keeps it steady so the first thing you got to do to take these apart is loosen that that screw up and once you loosen that up now you see it's you're able to wiggle it around now back here there is a little lever that you have to pull at the same time you pull up on the on the contacts themselves while sorry because i'm doing this by one hand but you pull up and now this comes right out at this point you're able to work on the contacts if you need to work on or you can replace your faulty component which for me is the green push button and yeah that's pretty much it if you want to put this back these have a little arrow right there you see that where it says top and over here you can see we have a little arrow as well so all you got to do is literally just line those up like this and it drops right in. It clicks, you can hear an audible click and you would just tighten your screw back up to add tension to the contacts. That's pretty much it. Uh, just wanted to do a really quick video and hopefully, you know, I could help somebody out because usually when you walk up to something like this, it's full of wires and now you're there trying to figure it out well, sometimes you have more than six, seven con conductors that are probably live and and the machine might be down and it's like you have to try and figure this out while there's another issue happening. So I hope this helped you guys out. Thank you so much for watching. Have a good one.